In case you missed it, a Southeast Texas man has confessed to indecency with a child. Sour Lake Police Chief Aaron Burleson tells 12 News a child younger than 12 reported the alleged abuse. Officers brought Federico Rodriguez in for an interview and a polygraph. Chief Burleson says that's when Rodriguez offered a full confession. He's charged with second degree felony indecency with a child. Friends and family will gather later this week to remember Pastor Charles Burchette. He led First Baptist in Kirbyville for 43 years. He died Monday. Visitation for the pastor will be Saturday from 5 until 8 at the church and his funeral this Sunday at 3 p.m. also at the church. Burchette was 74. Time is running out to apply for rent relief in Texas. The portal reopened yesterday and it was set to stay open through March 28th. But today, the Texas Department of Housing and Community Affairs said they'll be shutting it down early after they receive more than 70,000 applications. So the new deadline is tomorrow. The state has roughly $96 million to offer to Texans in need. Protesters gathered today in Amarillo as a federal hearing on abortion medication was taking place. This injunction was requested by the Alliance for the Hippocratic Medicine. The group is challenging the FDA's approval of Mufepristone. That's a medication used with another drug for chemical abortions. The protesters want the drug taken off the market nationwide while the case proceeds. No word when a decision could come.